I was looking for a broader framework and you know discovered systems theory, systems thinking. Uh, this was during the 1970s. And uh, I think this was, you know, after maybe mm. 10 years after Castaneda. Yes. And, uh, but I should also say that uh, the teachings of Don, Don Juan is only the first of a series of books of Castaneda. And I read the first four books, I think. And right. especially the first three, the second one is called A Separate Reality. And the third is called Journey to Istlan. Mm -hmm. And those three books are sort of a triad where, where he sort of expounds this uh, Yaki philosophy. And yes. all three had a big influence on my life. Uh, the influence was um, uh, not so much uh, theoretical in terms of philosophy and theories, mm -hmm. but more practical. Right. I, you know, in addition to practicing meditation, which mm -hmm. was at that time and still is in the form of Tai Chi, I'm mm -hmm. a practitioner of, of Tai Chi as a meditative right. practice. Okay. But at that time, I also took the teachings of Don Juan as practical instructions, you know, to be aware of my environment, to uh, there, there's one saying where Don Juan says, every now and then there's a cubic centimeter of chance that pops up in your environment. Most people don't see it, but the man of knowledge or the warrior picks it up. Wow. And, yes. and I took this as a, a personal, you know, guideline for my life. I became very sensitive and I came across um, information across ideas in a sort very often in a sort of synchronistic way that that was a little magical a, a little a little miraculous mm -hmm.